Sometimes, after a night of partying, you wake up, and as soon as your eyes crack open and the light comes in, you're immediately aware that something has gone wrong. You don't know what it is, but you know, even before you're fully awake, that something is afoot, and you are kind of scared. What? Nutella. Oh, that's right, for the ham. Quickly, and with no small amount of effort, you survey the scene, looking for a clue, before finally taking a moment to make sure all your limbs are intact and you still have your eyebrows. Oh, man. Oh, man. Not again. Oh. oh that's the third time this week. Hey, don't you judge me. We've all done it. Whatever. Anyways, after taking stock of your situation, you begin to comb your phone for clues. Ah, I remember that. Which is oftentimes no help, and yet very enlightening at the same time. Okay, let's start from the beginning. It was the day that would change my life for at least the next few days. I was getting ready to enjoy a sandwich with... You know, the last two ingredients in my entire house. When suddenly, there was a knock at the door. As it turned out, the one piece of mail that I had been waiting for finally arrived. My tax return. Fifty bucks? Now, whether you have more money than brains, or more brains than money, all depends on how much money you are holding at a given time. I'll give you one guess which situation this one was. I'm fucking rich! <laughs> <sighs> which brings us to today. <laughs> Yeah, you don't need to see any more of that. Needless to say, when I had a shower, I had to stomp the chunks down the drain, though. <sighs> Seeing as how I still have money left over, and I polished off all of the Nutella and ham, which was good, I'm going to go out to eat. Because I'm not cleaning this place up right now, and I damn sure don't feel like cooking. Now, a lot of people will argue about which fast food franchise has the best what and this and that, but when you're rich like me, you can just afford to cherry pick from all of the fucking different places and just frank and fuck them into one awesome meal. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's been kind of a rough go lately. I've been losing a lot of money at the track and at the tables and dog fighting's just not as lucrative as it used to be. I mean, my parents only had one dog and, <laughs> well, long story short, I owe my parents a new dog. Sorry, bud. So here we go. I am going to drive out to five different places. I'm going to pick up all the ingredients that we need and we're going to make something awesome. Let's fucking do it. Ta-da! And we're back. Okay, so we got some stuff here. So, we have food from Wendy's, KFC, A&W, Mickey D's, and Subway. Now, right, here's what we're going to do. Step one, make some room. Now, the thing is, we're gonna use the bun from the Big Mac because it comes with this awesome little separator bun here, right in the middle. We don't wanna eat the meat. So, we're gonna take our little separator, get rid of that. Boom. Yeah. Because Wendy's has the best meat, we're going to use the meat 
from a Wendy's number two, a double. This is going on here. And then we get our little separator in there. So, move that up there, there, and then there. Boom. Now, since McDonald's let me down with bacon last time, I decided to get extra bacon from A&W, which, okay, not great, but still, there is more bacon on there than there was on the McDonald's burger. Just throw that to the side. Now, for condiments, since a Subway sandwich is basically just one huge fucking condiment sandwich, we're gonna take all of this, and it's going on here. Banana peppers, cheese, roast beef, mushrooms, spinach, all of that. Everything's going on top of there. There you go. Look at all that cheese and roast beef. Yeah. Just take that and get rid of that sandwich. And a piece of the resistance, you take KFC extra crispy chicken skin. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, you bet. Yeah, that's what's happening there. Oh my god. Now, you look at that fucking burger. You tell me what you think about that. That's a fucking burger. Put some fucking KFC fries in there because they make the best fries. And now we eat. So, we got our burger. And I know, don't worry, I didn't forget the drink. I chose carefully because you're fucking lying to yourself if you think I'm not sleeping through the rest of this hangover. So to drink, we got this. I'm going to dig into this fucking thing. You guys are not going to believe this. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. My God, that is amazing. Holy God, that's good. Not even kidding. That is fucking incredible. Mm. Since this day has turned out so fortuitous, it's time I made a call. Yeah, shaky. How's it going? Hey, <laughs> yeah, I know. Hey man, uh, why don't you give me uh, 50 bucks on uh, Killer to win? 5 to 1. Against. Shit, yeah, brother. Lock that shit in, man. I'll take that action. <laughs> All right, man. I'll see you later. Man, I think my luck's just about to change. <laughs> Okay, so minor miscalculation. For the next little while, we will be doing all of my videos from uh, the park where I now live. God, I would kill for some wiener water soup right now.